Rest in peace to the haters. Get out of here. Celtics, Knicks, Pacers. Get out of here. Hawks, Nets, Lakers. Get out of here. Ain't no room for the fakers. Get out of here. Rest in peace to the haters. Get out of here. Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? This is Big Tone for Big Tone Open Sports Talk. We're coming to you today, this afternoon, man, with a Big Tone special uh, report, man, on Jimmy Butler's Jimmy Butler and why uh, they hate Jimmy Butler on the Miami Heat and why they want him traded. They, they're advocating to get him traded from the Miami Heat so hard uh if, you, if you're listening to this broadcast man hit the like hit the subscribe button for me man show your love leave me a comment and everything and i just want to uh get to it but like i always do in all my streams um i hope that when y'all woke up this morning man no matter what you're doing through your day i hope you put god almighty first the creator of the heavens and earth and everything in between and our ancestors in jesus name amen Amen. Amen. Now, I, I want to jump into this. I'm going to try not to be too long. I'm going I'm to get straight to the point on why these clowns are pushing so hard to advocate to get Jimmy off the Miami Heat based on what he's done. Now, many of you can say that's in the past, what he's done lately. Well, we don't know what he did lately because uh, this season just started. So we don't know what they're doing, but it's looking good. I can tell you that the lately is looking good lately. Yeah. Um, as of last year, last season, uh, you know, uh, first time <clears throat> Jimmy and, and three, four others was out injured, severe injured where they couldn't, couldn't even play. So we know what happened there with the in, injuries. And I'm also going to point out the hypocrisy when it comes to the Miami heat. And 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 again, I, I I'm going at the haters, but I'm really putting a dagger in 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 you fans. I, I'm so disgusted. I am so disgusted with the Miami Heat fans, man. But I, I'm gonna get to it, man, because y'all disgust me, bro. And you know who you are, your fans, who you are talking this Jimmy Butler trade foolishness, your ungratefulness. But um, the reason why these people want Jimmy Butler uh, off this team. And away from Bam Adebayo and uh, Tyler Hero. You, when Jimmy came in in the 2019-2020 era of the Miami Heat, and he started his era with the Miami Heat, Jimmy Butler basically did what no other player has done, right? He came right in, took, took the Miami Heat straight to the finals. Uh, you can say bubble. You know, I, I'm, I can even agree with you, whatever the case may be. I can agree with you that it was a bubble, so it wasn't. But even, even before the bubble, if many of y'all remember now, Jimmy Butler and the Miami Heat was really on the tear, man. Uh, Tyler, Duncan, all rookies um, was really doing their thing. Then the next season, uh, which was a quick turnaround, uh, definitely injured, uh, a riddle with injuries, man. Um, they got knocked out the first round, swept by M Milwaukee. Um, cool Milwaukee did their thing. It is what it is, fluke uh, championship. But they got one. They haven't been back since. Then Miami regrouped. G Lee's the most undrafted players on a team in NBA history. I think Miami had nine undrafted players, and three of them undrafted players. We excuse me, y'all. We always call. You know what we call 7 Eleven players that we went and got. The the young man guy, Caleb Martin, and it was one more that we got who was literally at home. We call it 7 Eleven players. And Jimmy Butler and Bam out of Bayer, because remember, even in the 22 uh season, Tyler even was hurt then. Tyler got hurt then and 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 um uh, uh, uh Vic was hurt. And then I think we got Kyle Lowry in. And during that time, Jimmy Butler and Bam Adebayo, basically, we became with the role players, Gabe Vincent, Max Struess came in because Gabe was with us with the 2020. 
Jimmy Butler took role players, him and Bam out of Bayou, literally role players, 7-Eleven players, to the best record, to the best record in the East. We was number one seed in 2022. We was also injured. So he didn't just take role players, G League players, and 7-Eleven players to the Eastern Conference Finals as the number one seed. He took an injured Miami, and him and Bam Adebayo took an injured Miami Heat team. An injured Miami Heat team. Caliper to the number one seed back to the Eastern Conference fight. Where even injured, remember in that 22 season, because see, many of you clowns, you, 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 you amnesia, or you just suckers. Jimmy and Bam even injured Miami Heat team with role players and 7-Eleven players, took Miami Heat number one seed back to the Eastern Conference Finals and took Boston Celtics, who was healthy. To seven games. And it came down to a Jimmy Butler missed shot. The so-called top tier team that they had over us from the beginning, every year, 2020, 2021, 2022, don't make no difference. Every year, they are the best team better than us, supposed to be the best team better than us. And an injured, rattled Miami Heat, number one seed, G Lee, seven league players, some uh, seven eleven players, took them to the Eastern Conference Finals down to one shot, and we missed it and lost. And then we came back with most of them seven eleven players and G League players, and went back to the Eastern Conference Finals from the eighth seed, injured and all. This is what Jimmy Butler brings to the table. Injured and all. Him and Bam Adebayo. And we went back in 23. And not only went back from the eighth seed all the way to the Eastern Conference Finals with a riddled, injured Miami Heat, no Tyler Hero, Bam and, and, and uh, Jimmy again by himself with a riddled, injured Miami Heat, and went back to the Eastern Conference Finals and went back to the Finals, injured and all, playing a healthy number one seed Denver Nuggets. And the only team the only team to beat Denver on their court the second game Jimmy Butler injured Kyle injured Tyler out <clears throat> Jimmy on one leg and still got him to the final This is why they hate Jimmy Butler. This is why they don't want him to stay teamed up with Bam Adebayo. Now, we know what happened last year. We simply was just riddled with even worse of injuries because we had five players out last year and got bounced and still got, got a game on Boston's field. Injured and all. No Jimmy Butler this time. And we got bounced in the first round. Gentlemen swept, as you were calling. Our injuries. This is why these haters doesn't want Jimmy on our goddamn team. No other player. All you fake Miami Heat fans who want Jimmy gone. No other player that you want on this team has ever did what Bam and Jimmy have done. They know the value of Jimmy 
on this team with Bam out of Bayou. And now Tyler coming into his own like I, I knew he would. All you bastards every two seconds wanted to trade Tyler. Now you're on his job. You're disgusting. This is why they don't want Jimmy. This is why the trade cry is so loud. Because they know what this team can do with a Jimmy Butler, a bad amount of volume, and a Tyler Hero, and even a young man, Jovic. And now we even got another di a diamond in the rough, Drew Smith, locked down. Defender coming into his own. They see what you dumbass so-called fans don't see. You are disgusting. This is why these people want Jimmy Butler. No other player in history has done what Jimmy and Bam done with the roster that they have. This is why the outcry is so loud. Fear. Peer D fear of the Miami Heat. Jimmy Butler and Bam out of body. And now so to all you clowns, you haters, we know you're going you're gonna to do everything you can and definitely going to pray that Spo, uh, 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 I mean, uh, uh, Pat Riley, Trey Jimmy. You're coming up with all, all these narratives. Coming up with all these talking points because you fear the Miami Heat. You see what the dumbass so called Miami Heat fans don't see. This is why they want Jimmy Butler off the Miami Heat, bro. Every, every team won because there's no caliber player that can do what Jimmy Butler did. With Bam out of body. So tap down this damn noise, trade noise. I expect that from the haters. 100%. I expect that from them. But you clowns, so called fans, ignoramuses, sit down, man. And see what's happening. I'm going to close it with this, man. The NBA fear the Miami Heat. Jimmy Butler, Bam out of Bayer, Tyler Hero. Take it or leave it alone. I don't give a damn what you do with it. And they're going to do everything they can to split that up. And they're going to make you think, which is not hard at all, you fake-ass fans, which is not hard at all. They're going to make you think it's all Jimmy. This is why they want Jimmy Butler off this Miami Heat team and that nucleus of Bam and Jimmy and now Tyler. They fear the Miami Heat. It's all about fear. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. Definitely leave me a comment, man. Let me know what you think. Hit me back. Um, I'm going on my live at 4.30. I'm ready to go on my live in a half an hour. Y'all hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button, man. And tell me what you think, man. I'm Big Tone for Big Tone Open Sports Talk. Peace.
Celtics, Knicks, Pacers. Get out of here. Hawks, Nets, Lakers. Get out of here. Ain't no room for the fakers. Get out of here. Rest in peace to the haters. Get out of here. Celtics, Knicks, 